thought my friends were normal. But they're not normal, are they? These fragments of my mind, projected seamlessly against my surroundings. They're not real, but they are to me. Hi Grace, Dr. Jensen told me what happened. Well, you haven't been taking your medication, Grace. 300 milligrams of Clozeril daily. You weren't responding to Thorazine. You weren't responding to Haldol. Grace, it's vital that you take this medication. Do you really trust this woman? She doesn't know what's best for you. Trust me. I know what's best for you, Grace. Grace, she's Look invading on your privacy. She's violating you. She's going to tell the world. She's going to tell all your she's secrets. She's going to humiliate you, Grace. She's Listen going to, to laugh at them. Grace. Because you're a freak. Grace! Uh -huh. Tuesday, I told you I, I can't really hang out with you anymore. Oh, come on. Who doesn't have time for their best friend? And besides, we have catching up to do. I just don't think this is a really good idea. I mean, what have you been up to anyway? No. Leave me alone, please! Gracie. Gracie, you're all I've got. And quite frankly, I'm all you've got, too. Goodbye, Tuesday. Goodbye! What was so abnormal about my friend was not, in fact, their complete lack of existence but rather their intentions. Real friends don't tell you to steal, to kill. They pervaded my every thought, shattered my every ambition. Tuesday was wrong. She wasn't all I had. She was all I had holding me back. They were all holding me back. Their voices were so, so loud. So finally, I shut them up. Switching on this film today 